Good morning, Andrew. My name is Brandon Tonight here at Tamron Hyundai in Hoover, Alabama, of course. Um, I understand you're from Selma, Alabama. We want to get you here. Um, I've been talking to Shannon, and Shannon spoke with you yesterday and told me that you had a price range of about ten dollars to $12,000 um, on a vehicle. Now, I do have a car that's pretty close to that, and I'm going to show it to you, but I wanted to first reach out to you personally as from, from my perspective. is uh, I've only been in the car business for about eight months. I come out of the insurance business. I was a traveling salesman. Um, I drove all over the state of Alabama, so I know kind of what you probably should be looking for as far as mileage. You should be looking for a car close to 40, 000, 40 miles per gallon as far as gas mileage. Um, because if you get paid the way I got paid when I was a traveling salesman, it's all $10.99, and it's all you paying for the gas. Um, you might have somebody that wants to split that a little bit with you. I'm not sure. We'll talk about that later, but I'm going to tell you, I made a smart decision last year. I come out of a car. I got uh, involved in a hit and run one night. A woman run me off the road and just left me there. Um, and it caused me to have to buy a car. Well, when I bought that car, I did buy a car that was close to 40 miles per gallon. It's a great car for me. It's the smartest decision I ever made. It's actually a great car for me today. I'm still doing this because I'm traveling almost an hour to get here every day. I am glad that I made that decision. Now, one thing I had to think about is owning my own business, because I was 1099 that was actually owning my own business, is that this car payment is actually a write-off that you can use against your taxes. So the more car payment, the better. That's less that you have to pay Uncle Sam at the end of the year. Or possibly the maximum amount of money that you can get back because you actually have business expenses. So to go into further, I want to kind of show you that we have a bunch of Elantras. All these cars are going to get about 38, 39 miles per gallon. We have them ranging from 2012 all the way to 2015. We got uh, GLS models, we got SE models, we got a little bit of everything that you could want. Okay, these are going to be just a tad bit above your price range. These start from about 15 all the way to about 18,000, which is only going to make a difference in your payment at about 20 to 35 dollars a month. That might make me consider a lower mileage car for my business because I don't want to run into no problems when I'm in South Alabama or when I'm in North Alabama. When I'm three hours away from home, I want to know that I don't have any problems with my car. That's why I want to suggest one of these cars to you. Now these are four-door models. There is a couple two-door models. There's a couple six-speed models. Um, I'm just going to walk up to one. I think this is a 2015. It's going to be super clean inside, which it really doesn't matter. They're all the same model. They're all going to have the same interior. Now this one just happens to have a leather interior instead of a cloth interior. This is your loaded out model. It's got the nice Elantra uh, steps in it and stuff like that. This is a six-speed, matter of fact. Electric seating, Bluetooth, cruise control. you got to have cruise control if you're going to be traveling. I promise you, Andrew. You're going to be definitely wanting at it from going from one point of this state to the other. Now as simple as I show you that car, I'm going to come out of this car and I'm going to open the door in the car next to us and let you see it cloth into it, which looks just as clean, just as nice. This is probably a 2014 model, which you can see the dash and all is exactly the same. Still got your Bluetooth, your cruise control and all that stuff. Just something simple. You just need a gas saver, you know, getting forth, back and forth from work and doing what you got to do for your job. Save yourself some time and money. Uh, probably would want just a base model, I would guess. Um, no need for sunroof. We're trying to look cool. We're trying to make money, right? I know what it's like. I want you to follow me over here because I do have one more option that you might really, really like that's really close to your price range. It's actually cheaper than any one of these cars I have here. I've had this car on a lot for a while now. It's the reason that it is for sale for the price range you want to be at. Um, I'm going to put a special on for you to get you here. Um, I have this car right here. As you can see as we're walking up to it, it's this white Hyundai Elantra. Now it's a hatchback style, so I don't know if you're a traveling salesman, got boxes and stuff you need to carry around. This would make it easier if you were to do so. It wouldn't have a trunk, you'd have more space. You can drop the back seats. Uh, makes it very easy. This is a 2010 model Elantra. It is a five-speed model, so this will get you about 41, 42 miles per gallon on the highway be a very smart choice for you. Now you see it says 13000 on I'm going to make you an offer today that you can't do that. 12000 today is what I can do on it. And I know if you got to make it up here by tomorrow, that's fine. We can do 12000 for you to get you in this car. 2010 with only 10000 let me make sure, 677 miles. I actually personally drove this and taught somebody how to drive a five speed the other day. Great little car. You never even have to push the gas to change the gear. So I'm hoping that you can drive a five speed. I hope that you want to to get that better gas mileage. This will help you make more money and not have to spend so much. Come on inside. Let me show you the inside of it. It's got a black interior, so if you are carrying boxes or something that might be a little nasty, you don't have to worry about it standing up the interior. You still got all your power windows, power locks, but basically a pretty standard car. As a, as a business car, this would be a great choice. Be a great write-off. 
I mean, cheat the insurer. Of course, your insurance is all taxed right off too, so that really doesn't matter either. Now, this is a Hyundai Elantra Touring model. It's what they call it, and that's because you can actually drop them back seats. And let me show you how much room's in here. And of course, all your original floor mats here, and actually embroidered, make it real nice looking. I mean, I don't know how much space you need, but that's a lot of it, Andrew. Now, I want you to feel free to give me a call or Shannon a call. That's at 380-6250. If you have any questions for me as far as how it works traveling around the state, if you've never done it before, maybe you have. I don't care. I'd be glad to talk to you, Andrew. You can call me at 205-504-9348. Andrew, I look forward to hearing from you today. Thank you much.